The suspect seen on video walking out of a Home Depot store with carts full of tools last week was charged again today for a separate theft at Home Depot. Meanwhile, the federal government is cracking down on shoplifting and organized retail crime and says the public can help with complex investigations. Christy Tomashiro follows up. Hawaii retailers continue to fall victim to constant shoplifting. It's not just um, mechanical equipment, it's electronics, it's clothing, it's jewelry. What is behind that one incident can be, and often is, a larger organization. Homeland Security Investigations is calling the highly sophisticated operations organized retail crime. HSI says there are many players involved. From the top, you have the head of the organization, to the money launderers, the fencers who buy the stolen goods to resell, and the boosters who go out and steal the items. What we are working with is to work with prosecutors, working with local law enforcement, to say, okay, that's, that's where we start, and now we need to start putting together the organizational structure. By putting together those puzzle pieces, HSI says enhanced penalties could apply. Our goal is to really attack the organization and not necessarily just take away the individual. And at that point, we're going to be looking at higher level charges. We're going to be looking for money laundering. We're going to be looking for other types of activity. On the city level, the Honolulu Prosecutor's Office is going after habitual offenders. According to the Prosecutor's Office, from January 2022 to July 5th of this year, 48 cases have been charged. 24 cases are still pending trial. According to court documents, the suspect in the Home Depot theft was charged Wednesday for a separate theft at Home Depot on May 8th. He's expected in court on Thursday for last week's theft. We have to call it into the police department. We have to go to court and make sure that these guys are prosecuted. The public can help build these cases too. HSI says consumers should be on the lookout for suspicious items on sale. Branded products that are being sold way below market value, um, that will probably tell you that, you know, that the origin is not um, legal. Officials say if you see something, report it to police. Chrissy Tomashiro, KH12 News, working for Hawaii.